and that's promotion to level uh, lieutenant commander level, uh, rank 10 you're scheduled for a meeting with the top brass so you might want to update your uniform beforehand the admiral can be a stickler for that sort of detail after all didn't he just say that deja vu what's it that they say in matrix about deja vu okay So we can go in and create a new uniform. You don't actually have to. You don't. Ha you've got to speak to them, but you don't have to complete this. Welcome to section, my shop. But you don't. That's a fine replica uniform you have there, mid twenty third century. Yes, my compliments to your replicator. Now, if you'd like to update to something from this century, have a look around and let me know if there's anything I can do for you. Peekaboo, indeed. I can't remember Garrick being quite as Asaki as this guy, but Asaki, uh, Cardassian? Yeah, why not? Hello. You can alter your uniform and look. So... I had created the set of uh, uniforms for original series, but why not create one for the... Who's that next to you? Yeah, good question. Is that you? Right, let's just, just cancel out for the moment and just see if that was you. Now you're looking sharp. Yay, Professor Pachui. Nice to meet you. It's me, Mario. Absolutely. And that's the great thing. ESD is, is, is a good place to hang out when they're not talking politics. Um, though sometimes, I've got to admit, I do actually do throw some grenades into... Uh, uh, some of the uh, conversations and um, uh, it, it, it's, it's frightening how uh, naive some of our political scientists are uh, uh, on uh, on Earth space dock right so creating a new uniform to, uh, a a 25th century uniform as opposed to one of the 23rd century uniforms Odyssey is the one that they've created for the game and it's okay um, it's all newer than uh, anything that we've seen on uh, on screen other than the computer here um, I don't have the um, Picard, either of the Picard uh, uniform types. So I'm going to go with this one and apply this to character. And then I've got to just do some modifications because it doesn't do it. It doesn't pick it up crop properly. I think it's a one there. Um, rank of Lieutenant Commander. Which we've just been promoted to. Uh, we want the command insignia. For some reason, they've created a, an Odyssey uh, badge, but then they didn't use it in their uh, in, in their uniform. Not sure the reasoning behind that, but so I want the command one. This is, if you like, canon for the game. I'm not, uh, is it that one? No, it's not that one. Okay. And I'm being perhaps stupidly pernickety here. Um, the sh character is a captain of a ship and the captain of the ships are supposed to be um, 
uh, have white to to indicate they're a commander in there. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's good to see you here, Fuzzy Bunnies. Let's see if we can get a shout out working for you. It wasn't working earlier. Fuzzy Bunnies is definitely worth uh, watching. He streams Star Trek Online, amongst other things. Um, he's a student. Uh, we got an ad coming on here. It's, no, it's not giving a shout out. I'm sorry. Fuzzy Bunnies also is very worth watching, just like, uh, thank you very much. That wasn't called for, you know. Uh, I, I had a message when I logged on this morning, or rather this afternoon, to say that my shout out was I needed to have given attention to, but unfortunately I, I was already in the, in the treadmill to, uh, to, to go live, so I didn't have time to get it done. But yeah. Please give Fuzzy Bunnies a follow. If you right click on his name, you'll be or click on his name, you should be able to uh, go to his channel and you should be able to follow it there. Definitely worth doing. All right, so we're wearing our new uniform. Now you're looking sharp. I thought we were wearing the new uniform, but we will now. And we will go to talk to the temporal agent. So I have to fix my shout out so I'm off stream. So we're on our way to speak to the temporal agent, and here's the temporal agent. Welcome to the 25th century. We've been expecting you. Your new cover <laughs> identity is in place, and Admiral Quinn's expecting you in the office behind me. Report to him for your orders. Remember, do not tell anyone about your status as a temporal agent. Your goal is to observe and correct, not to interfere. Understood, and thanks. And now, at that point, my sh character is the temporal, has become the temporal agent, as in the temporal agent's uh, uh, promotion. Uh, we've received a temporal, uh, temp uh, temporal agent transponder, temporal transponder. And if we go here, we can see that because we've just ranked up to rank 10, we actually have something a, a box that we can claim that gives us some fresh kit. Do not talk about the Fight Club. First rule of Fight Club, indeed. Yeah. So, the Temporal Agent is like the Delta Agent, oh, sorry, Delta Recruit, and the Klingon Recruit, and the Gamma Recruit. They have this uh, gadget that gives them uh, bonuses. Uh, so this one, well, space weapons booster pack or space equipment booster pack, space console booster pack. So space weapons, let's actually claim it and then we can get the further information. So the space the ground gear to boost uh, is the first one, and it is one of a weapon, shield, armor, a a, ki a, spe a profession specific kit, and choice of one module for that kit. I think it's one. Um, if it's a uh, space weapons, one or more beam weapons, one or more cannon weapons. Space equipment, deflector, shields, impulse engine, warp core, one or more projectile weapons, uh, and the space consoles, one or more console, uh, and it tends to be what well, I've seen um, uh, neutronium plating twice, uh, EP, uh, particle um, one twice and a uh, for clink for the Fe federation a phaser console twice the klingon recruit tends tends to be dis um, dis 
disruptor. So we'll go with the ground gear and you can see that it's added a phaser auto rifle or, and then you've got the armors and it's bound to character so you can't sell it or anything. Right and if it's the first one of that uh, type the there is a then a bonus through to your rest of your team or rest of your account uh, that in I believe is delight dil, um, not dilithium in this case I think it's uh, reputation points oh we've got ad break sorry talking through an ad break And the ad break's about to come out. Finish. Sorry about the ad break, folks. I've missed that one. Talk to Admiral Quinn. I've recommended you for a command position on board a ship of the line. There are several fine ships available for an officer of your caliber. Head to the shipyard to select your new ship, then return to me for your assignment. Right. So that effectively is the end of the um, the temporal agent's uh, starting story. So uh, this now is almost identical to the standard twenty-fifth uh, century Starfleet starter. Now uh, only you're what, four ranks higher. <laughs> 